Hey everybody, welcome back to the world of Final Fantasy. Okay, so we're back in the first dungeon pretty much, because there's this rock here. Oh. I didn't know I needed Flutter, but good thing we had the Moogle. Flutter lets you fly to places you normally couldn't reach. Sadly, you can't fly fl forever. You can only use Flutter to take you short distances. You may be wondering why Tama, of all Mirages, doesn't have this ability. Well, Tama may be able to float around free as a bird, but she refuses to carry Lon. After all, it's his job to carry her. Whoa! What's it? Come up! Oh, uh, okay? Flying sure is fun. I could fly around all day. Boy, oh boy, oh boy. Did you just accidentally come up with a haiku? And who says boy, oh boy? Okay, I was expecting treasure. I wasn't expecting to go deeper into this place. So the monsters are still the same? Look who's here! I don't know, they're still the same enemies. Oh, wait. Those are definitely higher level enemies. Didn't realize that. Not in a threshold, so if we die, oh well. Let's make this good, dude. It's on. Still the same guys. That was a good fight. All right. Okay. Let's go. Come on, bring it. Predictable. Bad.
<clears throat> Might be a place to hang around for a while and gain some levels. Five SP. You can get some agility and you can get a blank space. as well as Foxfire. Zap fur. Okay. Thank you. 
Alright, so what do we have here? So it's Mega Potion and some tough enemies. Or, well, some Mega Items and... Uh, yeah. Okay, I'll have to remember this for this place for later. Of course you would miss. Good fight. That wasn't so bad. Yeah, this is a fucking place to be right here. Hmm. I'll be right back. <clears throat> okay, well, that's done. Alrighty then. I couldn't pass up the opportunity. I mean, it's right there. Come on, go! Right there, might as well take advantage of it. I mean, why not? Okay, so... Just pop up here really quick. Okay. So, Chicken Bow's got three... Sync bonus, stats have increased. Cool. So the Chickabo's got everything for him. I think this means So that other than that, so... Unlock transmogrification to the Behemoth. Tama... You got that, that, that. Alright, magic, magic defense. Just raise accuracy because you like missing everything in sight. Mithril. Oh, oh, no, no, not you. You. Okay, I got this stuff. That. So he needs one more point and he can he'll have everything for the uh gnome. Ew, you little shit basket. Punch. Subdue region. First strike. Okay, so he needs three more and his base form will be complete. You, you little shock muffin. What do you do? You got that, 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 that. You don't have shell yet. So give you shell. Fuck it, we'll open this up because I don't plan on using you anytime fucking soon. Da Moogle. Das Moogle. He can become... Okay, so the glow moogles are different. Transfer them into a coup pirate. That's... Definitely special. 
Force Nocturne. Wind Rhapsody. Interesting. What the fuck does a coup pirate do? Pharmacology. Interesting. So he's a drug dealer. Water Harmony, Strength, HP, Magic, Snowman Rondo, Triumphant Shout. I wonder if that goes to Glow Moogle. It would have to, because this only gives 28%. Black Knack. Oh, okay. So, actually, White... White Knack... Okay, we could have unlocked White Knack at level 10. So we'd actually don't need to catch that fucker. That was the Cactrot guy. He's also a level 23 thing, but whatever. We'll get him the unstacked evasion. And agility. The Night Claw. No escape. to prison case. And... We're gonna turn you into a black chocobo. We're gonna turn you... into a behemoth. Wow, he's... Oh! He's got 29... him to get the other <laughs> I 
Oh no, the sink the sink level's still the same, so. Oh crap, maybe I didn't need to use that cure seed on him. Oh well, we got the sink bonus from the choke from the little choco, regular choco chick. So that's interesting that it gave him all that. Oh, probably because he turned into a different thingy. But then again, it also up the sink level. So baby paleberry. Wait. Oh, wait, Pale Bear, those, that thing I couldn't fucking catch back in the goddamn... Choco chick. We get our Lord and Savior Demon Chocobo. Okay. Yeah, I just wanted to come back and smash that rock. You know, figure, oh, yeah, we got the rock smash ability, but you come back here and fucking smash this rock, and, you know, everything would be all peach keen. I was not expecting an area beyond that that had fucking enemies that gave me, like, 6,000 to 8,000 experience, of, you know, per battle. That was not something I was expecting. Glad for it, though, although that's probably going to make catching things pretty much well nigh impossible at this point. <laughs> I guess I gotta go down to the chip hole. What? If someone isn't able to raise their civic rank high enough, the Federation brands them a derelict and sends them to the slums, where they're forgotten. I know. How can it be so different from the next road over? I hear there are special attacks out there specifically devised to take out stacked opponents. If I ever ran into bad guys with moves like that in their arsenal, you can bet I'd get myself unstacked pronto. The moment Seronia joined the Federation, things around here took a turn for the worse. What could the Thane possibly be thinking? You know, from the sound of it, they must have joined up with the Federation pretty recently. I think now I'm starting to see what Princess Sarah meant. Well, for now, why don't we see if we can go talk to that Thane guy about the League of S? I'm probably wasting my breath, but try to watch what you say around here. Uh, sure. Looks like the Thane's manor is at the very tippity the top of the town. Let's move it the out! But I'm not done exploring the shithole. I have to go explore the shithole more. I hear there's special attack. Oh, 
All I want is to be able to live my own life. Is it so wrong for me to seek my own path and not strive to become an architect? Everyone tells me I should strive to become an architect, but there's only so much you can do when you've been around as long as I have. Seaweed, clams, fish? Hmm. Huh. Cult fan issue two. Today we'll be looking at the so-called treasure ship whose phantom-like appearances have been causing bedlam in the port town of Saronia. Cult fan has obtained exclusive info revealing the ship is decked out in jewels, and speaking of decks, his galleon's gangways are said to be overflowing with treasure. Well, there's only one way to find out this fairy tale was full of fairy fail. So we sh shoved off in search of the truth, but here's the funny thing, a local fisherman claimed he had once seen... No one had ever seen the ship out on the water. Then where was it seen, we asked him incisively. Well, here's the scoop. Whenever the treasure ship needs repairs or improvement, it docks at a dungeon-like harbor. Everyone who's seen it reported hearing chimes. Some have tried forcing an encounter by ringing a series of bells, but... To this, the ship does not respond. After thanking the fisherman for his re 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 revelatory contribution, we decided to get our quanchos in a row. What did we learn? First, there's a clear connection between the chimes and the ship's appearance, but random bell ringing wasn't cutting it. Speaking of cutting, that was my you know, that was when my traveling companion Wedge cut in. Maybe you have to ring them in the right order. Great goblins, what if he was right? That would explain why the ship had to come. No one knew the right order. If the person chiming the ship home lives somewhere in Saronia, then it's possible the port town's hiding some kind of vital clue. We resumed our investigation with new vigor. Hmm. Okay. So, if there's chimes or something... If we find something involving chimes, then there's an order to it. Something, then there's something scribbled on the wall about seaweed. Seaweed. I clam said forget shells. a scram, kid! Will you just listen to what I have to say? Is that Refia? Uh, you caught up! What's going on here? Are they giving you trouble? I already told them that the Thane is my uncle. I'm not allowed to talk to my own flesh and blood now? I don't care who you're supposed to be, because you ain't seeing him! Dude, what? Well, you see, sir, we are here to meet the Thane, on behalf of Princess Sarah of Cornelia. Have a look for yourselves. That's the Cornelian seal. What now? I expected better from you, considering you're practically our neighbors. Yeah, you tell him, Rain. Cornelia's got giants for emissaries? They got some kind of royal Cornelia thing with them. What? You sure? Beats me. You gonna send them packing and take the risk? Wait here. I'll go check with this Thane ship. The Thane says he'll see you. Let's go, Refia. Huh? Hey, the girl stays here. Refia is part of our entourage. That's right. She just anteceded us. What? Toodaloo. Thank you, guys. You're always there for me. No big deal. Yeah, I mean, it wasn't a lie. We were all heading in more or less the same direction. Why don't you just pick him up and, like, you know, kick the baby? Don't kick the baby. Kick the baby. You must be the giant emissaries from Cornelia. Oh, uh, yes. We're here to... I hear the Federation finally gave up and just invaded them. Are you telling me the invasion failed? Hmm? Are you here to ask for my help? Yes, they did try to invade, but for the moment... Who are you? Hmm? Why, Refia, is that you? Who are you? 
My dear, please. It's me, your uncle. No! You are not Uncle Taka! Wait, sorry, what? <laughs> then I was right. If you've managed to see through this facade, then there's no mistake. You are a medium. Yes, I was wise to make sure you left town, and to ensure that you never returned. Where's Uncle Taka? Why, he's standing right in front of you. Make no mistake, little girl. This is your uncle. What are you... How intriguing. This must be an act of fate. The giants from the hills here, and with them, a champion's medium. Hmm. And not just any medium. One that bleeds the same blood as this body. <laughs> it's more than fate. It has to be destiny. How can I not rise to it? That answers that. He's the one who put up the threshold here. Oh. Yeah, better not kick it. He just the change sizes the way that you two do. So, is he a Bahamutian soldier? Well, he's nothing like the ones we fought so far. Be careful. Cross slash. Come on! Please. All right, just beat the shit out of him. I expected better than that. Critical. Ah! Come on, Black Chirp Chickabo. Fucking regular attack. You disappoint me. Still point All me. right. I'm cross -cut Predictable. Like the fuck was I doing cross cut for? So much as inquire, an imbecile beyond belief to let a medium to champion a fire! Uh, okay. That's not good. Away from death, away from life they stay. Contain the more you'll- <laughs> Quick, this way! Huh? Huh? Isn't that the same- Well, are you guys coming or not? <laughs> uh, okay. Right. 
The gods would caution us. Is this a sign that will not go unchallenged? That there's no way to know the pieces are alive? <laughs> Okay then. Whew, that was too close. Shalada, thank you. Huh? huh? I just knew you would get yourselves in trouble. And boy, did you prove me right. Ah, what do you call that creepy trick? You are the creepy one oh, here. She has a tail. Unbelievable. <sighs> would you just put these on? Then take another look at the town. <gasps> Obey. What the honk? Consume. Huh? Is that coming out of the sky? Let the me! I want to have it the turn! Hey! Rebia! You should have a look too! How do you explain this? Don't expect any help from me on that one. After all, not even the visitor who left those monocles at my inn could tell me exactly what it's showing us or how. From what I was told, every member state in the Federation is trussed up like this. So, I thought I'd bring the lenses here, but maybe I didn't have to. The Thane was visibly crazy. What in Grimoire is going on? Uh, okay, guess we'll file that one under no one knows. So what do we do? We came here to ask about the League of S, but all we found was a lot more questions. Sorry. Did you say the League of S? That's right. The League of Charlotta. Oh. If that's all it is, then maybe I can help you out. You can? Oh, sure. I know a few people right here in Seronia who should be able or to get Seronia. in touch with the League. I'll ask them to pass on your message. Do you mean it? Thank you! Charlotta's been around a lot longer than she looks, so she knows tons of people. Isn't that great? Don't you talk about my age. <laughs> so, like, what's with you and the catamorphosis? That is a very long story that I don't feel like telling. But I will say this. Cats get around. Huh? Yep. Oh, uh, that's cool. Yep. So, the real question is, what are you two planning to bite off next? We've still got a lot to puzzle over. But now that the League of S thing is settled, I think we'd better resume our quest to find mirages. Yeah. Plus, we've got that castle. And Mom to track down along the way, too. Sounds pretty good to me. From here, the best place to go next would have to be the Low Seas. In which case, you basically have no choice but to find a boat down at the docks. I guess this is the last town on the continent. Okay, then. We'll figure something out. So what about you two? Are you coming back to the Solace, Refia? The wolves have been taken care of now, so the only thing to fight off is the cold. Sure. I need some time to digest this business with Uncle Taka. The Solace sounds great, if you'll have me. Of course I will. Well, you two, thank you so much for everything. Best of luck in all your adventures. Thanks. Take care. Hey, Sherlotta. Thanks for stepping in to help. Sure. Speaking of stepping in, I don't suppose you were planning to make it up to me? For trouncing on my tail? <gasps> oh, so that really was you. Gosh, I was kind of hoping you'd forget. Refuse Champion Medal. Okay. Chapter 8, Buccaneer Blues. We're about to go on the water in a boat. So let's see. Refia said to borrow a boat at the docks and head to the low seas. Well then, why don't we try asking around town and see if anyone's renting them out? I wonder if we're going to run across a certain pirate. Hmm. Here, run here, run 
Honestly, no, I don't want to buy it. I mean, if we're going on the ocean, it'd be the perfect time to, like, throw Furious in there. Hey, did you hear? There's a real pirate ship in the harbor. It's so cool! Is it drawn by a water dragon? Did you just say you want to take a boat to the low seas? Are you sure about that? You're heading for the low seas? That's completely insane! I can't lend you a boat, but I'm rooting for you. See about off to the velvet room. Hey, Philomona, want some tea? What now? Which champion would you like to awaken? You're not even going to tell us what these do. Now, whose soul will you touch? Or art thou smoochy poo? Castle Cornelia is in an uproar. The princess has been kidnapped by the princess goblin. And who knows what foul tortures the fiend has in store for her. The warrior of light sallies forth to the goblin camp to rescue her kidnapped highness. And the ice bridge. Raphael returns to Sherlada's Shir solace for some well-needed R&R through Saronia. She gets to thinking about how dangerous the passage across the ice is and decides to look for a way to create a safe route through. After talking with Sherlada, the two of them head for the head to the Nether Nebula. Mm hmm. Never cross the boss. Sherlada and Raphael are. Out and about among the ice, while searching for a mirage that's been causing trouble. But the, f the figure in the looming snow, it's... Defeat the... A bridge's woe. And a crow has, dro has dropped in on Big Bridge Alexander. And they're having a blast talking about the good old days. Sadly, this wasn't just a social call. There's business to attend to. Anna Cross rolls up her sleeves and gets to work pulling out the cogna that she's been hiding inside Big L. I'm wondering what this one is. Okay, Charlotta. This is the place we heard about. Mm. It is f f freezing out here. Let's get this over with so I can go back to the inn. Right. Somehow, I don't think she'll keep us waiting long. Leave it. Leave it. <gasps> D did you hear that? She's here. Leave your gill and treasure and be gone from this place. Okay, I it was not what I was expecting. If the undead princess is royalty, she must be the rich. Uh, well, I guess it's possible. No, who else must be the wealthy? That skeleton, the mirage lich. Huh? <laughs> oh, I get it. Doesn't like fire. Lich, rich. <laughs> Well, too bad, princess. This is it. I don't have a guild to my name. And you're bragging? Well, technically, you don't let him veneer any of the money. So he's actually telling the truth. Uh. 
No, okay, so fire is actually the fire is actually worthwhile for her. Okay! Take this! Yet. <laughs> well, that ought to do it. Victory. So, what's the question mark item? me wow you're the strongest mortals i've ever seen i don't suppose such tough gals would be willing to whoa, 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 whoa. do you think she was trying to tell us something there maybe as long as she's not bothering this place anymore let's go home stop right there are you just naturally mean because i was all like don't kill me let's talk don't pretend you didn't hear me was I supposed to spare you so you'd stab me in the back? And why are you still breathing? Can't you take a hint? Let's try this again. Ah! I am so not breathing! Check it out! Dead as a doornail! Oh, I'm undead. The problem is I can't let creepy she-monsters scare folks away from my inn because that would basically put me out of business. <laughs> Shall we, Refia? Uh, remind me never to get on your naughty list. Look who you can't kill. What is it going to take? Charlotta, I don't think we're going to make much progress this way. Maybe we should hear what she has to say. You're way too nice for your own good. Now talk. And it better be worth it if you don't want a beating. Why are you so violent? Look, just for the record, I'm not doing this because it was my choice. Come on. Being a mirage leaves me with so much time to kill. So I said, fine, what the hey? May as well make a little bling bling off my hobby. So you're tormenting people just because you're bored? Oh, please don't hurt me. I'm just trying to give you some context. If my lady has a better idea, then hey, I'm all ears. So what you're saying is you don't know what to do with your unlife. Yeah, super lame, I know. I mean, all I've really got is this deep seated grudge, which is great for my hex life. But sometimes the magic just isn't there, even though it's supposed to be. <sighs> Alright, I get it. If I can't slay you, I may as well make you useful. Whoa, for real? From now on, instead of scaring adventures away from my inn, I want you to scare them towards it. If you can do that, you're hired. Cool! You really mean it? Yes, I'll do it! I'm on the job! And don't you go threatening them or stealing their valuables. Oh, I would never dream of it, mistress! Ooh, I have a purpose! Something to live for at long last! You just got through telling us you're dead. Well, that should take care of that. Revia, we're leaving. Oh, right! Hey, wait, mistress! I'm going with you! Nope, your job is right here, 24-7. What? Is that, like, even legal? Okay. So I got a prism for an undead. Okay then, I got a prism for an undead princess. Shall we get started? What now? Whose soul will you touch? A grudge that won't budge. The undead princess is working hard at her new job catching travelers and inviting them to Sherlock's solace. When the lady shows up, 
Charlotta en enlists the undead princess's help in banishing yet another undying spirit. This one probably also gives some kind of goblin related prism or something. What is going on here? Oh, Captain, terrible news. Her Highness has been abducted by the Princess Goblin. What? Did you say the Princess Goblin? This is bad. how they got in. Princess, are you all right? The warrior of light. Oh, I knew you would come. Oh, my warrior of light. Oh, there's my smoochy poo. So, have you thought it over? Will you make me your bride? What? His bride? Yes! Princess Goblin, I already told you my answer is no. Good! What? Surely you know my heart beats for one cause, my prin... Oh? The kingdom of Cornelia and all its people. Oh, is that all? Become my lovey dubby hubby, and my goblins will give you guys all the protection you will ever need. The way you gave that giant goblin a good spankaroonie, that is just the kind of manhandling the goblin army's been dying for. Uh, no, I have a duty. Ah! What about her dinkiness here? Could you possibly find more charming than me? If she's that special to you, I'll keep her nice and safe by imprisoning her for the rest of her life! Happy now? Isn't the realm in good hands? P please, no! Enough! Now you've gone too far! Well, I guess we can't blame you for falling for a dreamboat like the Warrior of Light. <laughs> But maybe you'd settle for Lon instead? This How about it. it? Sorry, there's no... Room for dummies on this battlefield. Is she playing hard to get? I okay. so intrigued. I... I don't think I'm ready for this. Are these feelings normal? Maybe for you? I've got this. Six fifty seven. Yes, yeah, so those are about the same. Okay, so cross slash really isn't all that impressive. What? Princess Goblin, it's over! Oh my god! Wait, Warrior of Light! Highness, <laughs> please step aside. I can't allow this evil mirage to continue in her foul ways. No! No, I will not. Despite her poor judgment, her heart is in the right place. Yeah! Can you blame her? Like any princess, all that she desired was a dashing gentleman. Oh, for sure! It is no less noble than what I do for my kingdom. Yes, it is. Princess. Now, uh -huh. if you genuinely wish to protect me, then please, put your sword away. Yeah, Very please. Very well. If it is your wish I show mercy, then I will stay my blade.
You're right. Her Highness is as caring as they come. Why else would I have fallen in the... Princess Sarah! Oh, I am so not worthy! You win! I must accept my defeat! So long! Oh, hey, from now on, I'm going to be a better ruler and look after my goblins! So long! Oh, and I hope there aren't any hard feelings. <laughs> so long! <laughs> and like, if you ever need me for anything, I'll be here in a goblin minute, so just say the word! <laughs> right. We'll keep you posted. and courageous princess she turned out to be. A fine ruler, willing to change when necessary. Just the sort of example I should strive to imitate. No, your highness is fine the way you are. If you need help, I will always be there to assist you. <laughs> I am beginning to see I am in good hands. Thank you, sir. Y your highness? There's no telling what mirages might lie just around the bend. I trust that you will keep me safe until we return home? <sighs> right. Then I suggest you stay as close to me as possible. <laughs> I love thrilling adventures. We should have another one. Oh, no, no. We need to adopt a strict no more abductions rule. Never again. I don't think that's the kind of adventure she was talking about. Just saying. And Princess Goblin Prism. Hmm. Oh, fuck it. We can do like one more. Need some? What now? Whose soul will you touch? So you get ethers. Two holy torches. Eh. Yeah, we'll get another special one out of this, so. <clears throat> but you have such a long road ahead of you, no? Why don't you rest a spell at that nice little inn over there? Oh, um... That's quite all right. Thank you. I'm not tired. And I need to cross the ridge by nightfall. Ugh, you know what? <sighs> uh, s strength fading. Ugh. Oopsie. Now I've really gone and zombified the pooch. Well, no one's gonna blame me for helping young people go green, right? Hey! Any luck drawing in customers? Oh, milady! Hello! I was just about to take this gentleman here to the solace. Huh? What's the matter with him? Looks like he's already got one foot in the grave. Yeah. Uh, I'll bet you he's just hungry, right? You'd better take him back to the inn, on the double. Hmm, okay. Refia, get this young man set up with the meal. Undead Princess and I are gonna check out that lead. Sure, good luck, and watch each other's backs out there. <laughs> so, uh... What exactly is this lead we're chasing? Oh, there's been talk of a really obnoxious mirage haunting these parts. From what I hear, it's just as irritating as you used to be, which means I need to dispose of it. And you're helping. Well, why don't you tell me how you really feel about me? In here, I thought you cared. Boo-hoo! Come on, Death Breath! Hey, my lady, wait for me! Okay, the little side stories are, are interesting. So this is the place then? Swank! The ground here is nice and damp. You couldn't ask for better turf to work up a grudge. Really? I never thought this region would be prime real estate for mirages like yourself. Who goes there? Who has come to trespass upon my domain? This land is mine. Be gone at once.
I may not be rich, but I've got lots of courage. Hardy har. You remember the rich lich joke. So is this your passive aggressive way of telling me you Come want on. me to give you some money? Maybe. Okay, very well. Here's one gill. Woohoo! One gill. Now I can buy Hey, wait. I can't buy anything with this. Uh, look out! Well, hey, hold <laughs> on. This discussion isn't over. <laughs> Oh wait, maybe Cross Slash hits all enemies. Random shock. One. Fucking missed. Trouble at all. Victory. Man, nah, three Phoenix Downs. Ooh, who put the wrath in these wraiths, huh? And here I thought I had a nasty grudge. At least they had the good sense to disappear in the end. Yeah, sure did. <sighs> So why is it you can't find the grace to just fizzle out? What? Why would you say something like that? You don't like having me around? I wonder. Maybe you'll pass away properly if I work you a little bit harder. Whoa, 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 whoa. I was kind of hoping to put my roots down here in the physical so, plane if that's cool I think with... we should head back and check on our guest. Uh, oh, okay. Hey, listen. I'm pretty useful to have around. Did you know I can do tricks? Yeah? What kind of tricks? Oh, well, like, uh... Funny faces! Hurry up! Check this out! Don't quit your day job. <laughs> Metalliskull Prism. Eh, okay. Anyway, we're... I'll go save back over by the one thing. Arrgh. Oh, what time If the one got? of your mirages has unlocked the Joyride ability, you can be hitch a ride on it as long as it's in your lineup. Nah. Okay. Oh, yeah, we got, we got more ju... Oh. We didn't get more jewels. Alright, 
Let's go to this. Restore HP and remove status ailments slash stun. Seems like a good one to have. Well, we've, we've seen what fucking Bitcheroth does, so... We haven't seen what the Warrior of Light does yet. So for one star, she's a heal, and... Okay. Thank fuck it's actually, you know, a character that... Ugh. I, I hope, like, hell... Eris is not in this. It's like the last motherfucker I want to see. Because I could have seen Eris doing that shit. Oh, look, she can heal you and stuff. It's like, oh, great. I'm just gonna, like, not buy that. Because... Fucking airheaded bitch. Anyway. Uh, yeah. I think we're called at night. See ya.